Where the, hell, where the hell are you? Why did you leave Abe's? Our plan was to hide somewhere until we're no longer public enemy number one. Yeah, that was before I, that was before I found out what you did. Exposed a government employee. Take a close look at what happened. They're after us now for sure. Was that necessary? Look at TMB. We've de developed a following. If they prosecute us now, it'll be a public outcry. This tiny crowd with their banners we don't, won't stop a thing. We'll be gone forever once they get us. This is why I had to leave. Did you get Abraham's email? Yeah, that was crazy. I know, all of a sudden he's backing as a plan. What does he? Or is he lying to you? I can't believe it. Where was he this whole time? Will you attend this gathering? Oh, he knows that they wouldn't trust him if he'd like organized something. So he's like, I, 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 I gotta get everyone back together. But... Interesting, okay. Is hiding somewhere where she has not stayed before in the last 24 hours. Of course, if Abe's there, we must attend. Yeah, he's like, if, 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 if I say if I say I'm Abraham Goldfels and we need to meet up, everybody will meet up. Uh, don't hide anywhere you have to uh, where you've been to in the last 24 hours. So the maps are useless to us, right? Will do. My damn phone is gone, just like you disappeared this morning. You haven't seen it by chance, have you? Jeez, can you not take care of your stuff? No, I've not seen your phone. Oh, fuck it. Tried to track it down, but it doesn't send a signal. Probably out of battery. Whatever. I'll go without it until the gathering. Yeah, until the gathering. Okay. The maps are not useful. It's good job I didn't go, hey, he's been here and locked down these locations. Do you know where we know he hasn't been? Do you know where he, you know where he was like, I haven't been? He hasn't been home. He hasn't been to see his mom. Uh, lost his phone. Relevant? Relevant? I don't know. Presumably it's locked, right? I mean, not to us, but to anyone else. I can still get to his phone. What's his battery like? Can we see his battery from here? So Sky Chat with his mother. That's his mother. Oh, that's what we took from that. These 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 are useful informations. April sixteenth. He didn't come home in the last twenty-four hours. I won't be coming home today. When are you coming? I'm not coming. Are you coming? I'm not coming today. He didn't go home in the last twenty-four hours. Oh, I missed I missed things. Meet tonight at Salvatore's. Oh, I guess that's Emma's marker. Sure, eight straight, straight eight. You're coming back tonight? Yeah. Gonna work my shift at CCC. Back at uh, oh the chestnut tree, right? Back at six. Remember when we back at CCC? Those were days. You kept attracting attracting all the guys while I kept pissing them off. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Nope. No useful information there. Crap. How do we find out where he's going? If I give them those locations, they won't find him. But we do know he's planning to meet at the chestnut tree, right? I mean, he hasn't been to the chestnut tree in the last 24 hours. We also know he hasn't been home, so the home is a potential one. What have we missed? Have we missed something here? It says there's a thing here, but I haven't missed... I don't know what I've missed. There's something in the list, no? Yeah. Oh, Victor Rosen. Oh, Victor. Oh, oh. That's a boss. Getting a personal call from one of the biggest tech giants in the industry. Carrington. You alert to Victor here. Oh, hey, Victor. I just talked to Maria. Why are you not at work? Oh, I, I sent a sick note. Didn't you? No, you did not. You were here the entire weekend. That's what the tracker says, but no one authorized you to do so. Now that you're meant to be here, you are not. Also, what is SP85560-1204 registered under your account? This device ID does not belong to a company approved device. I, I will explain these irregularities. I want you in my office as soon as possible. I, I don't think so. I don't think, I don't think she delivered it. I like, I don't think so. It's like, I'm not going to your office. Okay. So that is... Oh, it's not a company approved device, it's her device. I was like, has she stolen Harrison's phone or something? But... Yeah, that, well, that's, you, you, that, these are useful things. We've got 11 left to go. So we're gonna, we're gonna do that. Half our time is up, stay diligent and considerate. Well, we got, we got, we got into a phone. You were here the entire weekend. Was in the Roland office on the weekend despite not being ordered to do overtime hours. Huh. I don't know if that's useful or not. 
path. Desktop might be. So places... Right, places she's been in the last 24 hours, which are also not useful to us. I don't suppose any of that's really helpful at all. Because they're not going back there. Uh, Abraham Goldfell's. Abraham Goldfell's home phone number. That's a bloody good one to have, isn't it? This is a good one. Rootfields is dead. What do you expect to happen on this phone line? That is, that's a good question. But didn't they talk... Didn't they not so long ago talk about being at Goldfels' place? I feel like... Actually, I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Because um, um, Jules was in on that as well, on that conversation. So it made me think that, like, Harrison knew Goldfels was dead, so he'd, like, I guess had a funeral on the quiet somewhere and just sort of kept the house. Uh, well, you know. If something, if that phone line rings, you'll be glad. That's all I know. Uh, what else do we have? Gallery. Portraits. I will totally get in trouble for adding any portraits of anyone at this point in time. Chat. Chat is useful. Juliet, where are you? Hey, Dan, I'm at work. It's a beautiful Sunday, so we thought you could have a family barbecue tonight. April is here. I don't think I'll be able to come. Well, you're lost. Why are you working almost every weekend now, anyway? Did you miss a deadline or something? Oh, I got this new project here, which is close to release. Everyone's doing overtime. What a company. This should be illegal. I hope you're getting overtime. Poor choice to follow this Abraham creep. Just because he worked at Rosentech doesn't mean it's a good job for you. Oh, interesting. Dad, what? Seriously, shut the fuck up. I made the right call. I know I'm doing the right thing. How dare you talk to me like that? Don't even think about coming home anytime soon. You'll see. Yeah, you'll see. I'll make you see. Okay. Uh, sister. Hey, sis. How's thing? You there? Oh, hey, mate. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Family things. See you later. Oh, hang on. We're talking about where they're going to be, though. And this was on April 14th. Up for meet and greet with your long sis, long lost sis next week. Gonna hit B-Town on Wednesday and stay for three awesome days at A&D's hotel. Uh, hell no. Oh god no, gonna visit them once. That's already family overdose. Okay, so we know she's gonna be at A&D's hotel at some point on Wednesday, but it's not Wednesday. What date is it? I know what day date it is. I don't know what day it is anymore. Uh, can we... Can, we, can I find out what... You, Look, um, headlines is a good way to find out what day it is. No, it isn't. It still only gives us the date. Dang it, guys! Give us a day. Are there more headlines? Why is that? Oh, ah, oh! I I missed the other headlines. On the leader, Prime Minister Blaine negotiations, negotiations about restructured re-elections with the opposition have been resumed, leaving experts baffled. Trifleth, the Pargesian President Kassath has given the green light to resume negotiations about a re-election. This is the result that came from only one day of Prime Minister Blaine's visit to Trifleth, and is well interpreted as a beacon of hope for the crisis-riddled region. Under the supervision of the Prime Minister, Kassath and members of the opposition gathered at the round table in the Pargesian Presidential Palace after the talks had been discounted last week. I, I, look, I, I still can't read that word without it being Pargesi. Which I, I I'm also only aware of Parcheesi from Dr. Zoidberg banging on about Parcheesi that one time that he did, because ever because as far as I'm aware, the rest of the world calls it Ludo. But hey, yeah. Experts who had mostly predicted long and difficult talks are surprised by a sudden change of mind by Kassath due to the Prime Minister's intervention. Meanwhile, rights in Triflith went on but decreased its intensity significantly as many followers of the opposition called off their planned actions at the news of the round table gathering. Cool. And let's read the protest. Anti-Orwell protesters gather at Freedom Memorial Remains. Hmm. As the thought activists unveil Orwell, supporters gather at the memorial. Once again, Freedom Plaza has become the center of attention with over a dozen citizens protesting the ravaged Freedom Memorial on Sunday evening. The cause of the protest is the recent unveiling of Orwell, a mass surveillance program issued in secret by the government. The information was leaked by activist group Thought, the same group that was br brought to public attention as the alleged culprits of the Bonton bombings. The group claimed in a recent blog post that they had proof the government had plans to use this system to put the population of the nation under mass surveillance. We reached out to the government for statements about the Orwell project, but at the time of publication we had not received a reply. More on this story as it unfolds. 
Nothing we needed to know in there, but to get a little bit more about the world. What's, uh, have we had more comments in there? Why is that one still red? Do I need to know that? I don't know, man. Oh, we got, oh, her co oh, conversation with Initiate. That's probably a good one to have, isn't it? Probably some useful things there. Knock, knock. Hi, who are you? Here's Initiate. I'm a dog with shades on. I'm cool. Oh, yeah, this hacker guy Harrison spoke about, Ren. Right. Do you hack the thought blog? You've been following us around? Why? What do you want? What do you want? I want to know what happened to thought. Bongs have been ringing in my head. I, I just don't know. Was this thought's work? Was it a government set up? I don't know either. I'm sorry, but the shit is majorly going down the drain right now. If you can help us, do it, please. I help got you where you are right now. Being pursued by the police? You helped to dox this Costigan. Harrison, Harrison told me you wouldn't want to assist us. Don't talk so openly, or did you forget what's going on? Right, sorry. Can, can you do that again, what you did? Nope. <laughs> nope, not doing that again. Uh huh. Uh, okay, well, I guess I want that. This initiated you, and she must reveal his true identity. This might shed some light on what his motives are. Uh, I think I tracked me down for sure. Barely got out the last time. I need more intel on this thing first. I don't see a way. Damn. So, what are you doing? Oh, you don't know yet? Abraham Goldfels, you found it. Thought sent us a message. Thought should gather once more. What? Abe is back? Yeah, he says his plan. You know him? Kinda. Where from? Coincidence. I don't believe in coincidences. Look, if you know Abraham, why don't you attend this gathering as well? It's going down at 4 p.m. as conference call. Give me a number, I'll invite you as well. No. <laughs> thanks, but no thanks. Oh, they weren't. Why don't I have in my head they were meeting in the chestnut tree? No, it's a conference call, isn't it? Sounds like a trap to me. You shouldn't attend either. I'm pretty positive it's not. The, the email sounded authentic, but have it your way. I will. Good luck with this gathering. Good luck to you with finding out what's going on here. You're gonna need it. Okay. We can get any new documents out of that. Uh, I know. Oh man, I. We need to know where they're gonna be. And though the the tracking is not actually the useful bit of information I thought we needed, I thought it was doing really well. Actually, suddenly um. Dang it. Is anything useful in there? Nope. There was literally only one in there, right? Yeah. How many? Oh, we got. Ooh, hang on. We got a conversation between Cass. I didn't, I didn't go through all those. Alright, uh, hey. Romantic dinners. Go to the haunted house. Jules wants to go to the haunted house. It is a lot faster to go through Freedom Plaza. Uh, why don't you take the 9B? You know I don't like a place. Oh, sorry, although it is a lot faster to go through Freedom Plaza. Like, much faster. Uh, okay. Suggested Freedom, Freedom Plaza route to Cassandra Watergate. Gets on bus on the Freedom Plaza every day due to Juliet's suggestion. Uh, okay, so... Okay, yeah. She she did take that route. That, is that useful? I mean, is getting on the bus to the Freedom Plaza... Gets on the get gets on bus on the Freedom Plaza every day due to Juliet's suggestion. Is that useful information to us? I don't feel like that is. I mean, the only person we could possibly begin to think about tracking down with that is already under arrest. Does that mean Juliet takes it though? I feel like that might link us to something. Da -da -da. Hi. We might be able to go through the Rosentech files. Yeah, we can. Okay. We're not supposed to follow Abraham Goldfields. He's dead. You're wasting precious time. Yeah, but the things might be useful information. Employee information. Abraham Goldfields. Da 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 da. And he worked on. Oh, there's an oh, there's a that's an unusual looking picture of him. He's looking different. Very different. And worked at Rosentech on Demiurge. 
<sighs> That's not necessarily what I wanted. Is there anything, any other information I can get on Rosentech while we're here? Oh, is this the guy that's in charge? He looks very startupy. Victor Rosen, as a man, looking very, very, very sort of business smart, casual, very Silicon Valley. The Ten Commandments. Da, 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 da. Have we already been through those? We've been through those, haven't we? We've been through those. And yeah. The, and there's Julie Carrington, the PR assistant, listed on the PR page on the, the Get in Touch page. For, for a company with a lot of employees and for someone who's only been there a month, she's already on the website. That's pretty impressive. Uh, I mean, she keeps telling me off every time I do anything to do with Goldfells. That only kind of makes me think I'm doing it right, though. We're on the insider. Oh, browser history. Yeah, any what we got? Targets albums, National Beholder, timelines, Joseph Langley, Seligan. Duh, lots, of, uh, lots of things we've already seen. Rosen took into oh, I can't get into the internal database though. What's new on? Come on. What is new here? I'm not. I'm not sure what was here and what wasn't here last time. I guess it was just telling me to look at the at the browser history. Oh, she logged into Stelgen University webmail. Oh, right. I see. There's nothing terribly useful here except that it did pop. This this was a nice little bit of actual um, kind of. It was just a nice touch, really, is what that is. It's something popped up on Listener and something popped up on Insider at the same time. Her browser history got updated on her notebook at the same time as the Listener popped up. So, at the, which is when she logged into Webmail. So, if we go in here, she sent. Did she send? Yeah, uh, I don't know. No, she didn't send. Okay, she so she logged into webmail. Like, alright, right, fine, whatever. I thought I thought oh, damn it, I I thought I had a thing there that was just like that's a nice touch. So we can see she logged into her laptop uh, at the university to check her emails today, and presumably as an email would have popped up today. But no, but no. Initiate, I need to apologize to you for remaining silent for such a long time. I've been working out a plan in hiding. Stay, I need to call upon your help to make it happen. I'm aware of your capabilities and your skills. You need to stop trying to tear down walls instead of shifting to running through open doors. Here's where to find one. And an IP address. 4 p.m. today, Abraham Goldfells. Interesting. See... He didn't send this, though. He totally... God damn it. God damn it. Fine. I don't know why he's telling that as a gun to Aaron's, because he's dead. So yeah, they're going to try and attack all other once again. Well, let them come. Yes. Alright. Where are we up to? Six left. Six left. Yikes. Six left, and I still don't feel like I'm any close to actually figuring out where they're actually going to be. What's in here? It keeps telling me there's things in here. She planned the Freedom Plaza. I thought we already kind of knew that anyway. Do we not know that? Who did we think pl planned the Freedom Plaza? Planned the Freedom Plaza protest, huh? That doesn't add up. I don't know what to make of that. Because I think I think that's just like uh, she had the first thought and he actually did all the actual planning planning. Because up to now, they've been pretty thorough about explaining who did what in everything. What have we got left? There's not definite garbage. Why is that little red? There's literally nothing left. That's not useful. No. 
No. No. Dang it. Switching history. So, oh, right, so those three are all. I don't like I don't like this in I keep I keep like winding up on pages of the interface that I don't want to be on. That's a profile picture, that's locations, they're boring. They're locations, they're boring. Those are pictures, those are boring. That Can we find out something from like his insurance plan? Can we do that? Can we then like get documents from Life Trust? Can we find out who those family members are? that are covered on this? Why would someone like O'Donnell own a health insurance for a family member? Nah. Damn it, I was hoping I'd bring up some more documents. Search for Benjamin Costigan. Ugh, too, too trivial, I think. There's not a lot left to go on. Uh, Victor Rosa, da, da, da. you were here the entire weekend. She's presumably not going back to work just on the basis. Did I? Yeah, ooh. Yeah, so that that's, that's useful. Useful hint, if you encounter any hideout, hints to hideout locations, be sure to validate them by checking where they've stayed before first. Lost his phone, lost his phone. Um, that's not useful. I can't see that being useful. That's useful, but doesn't bring us any more documents, and I need more documents. I've got four opportunities to do this. I guess two of them need to be like two different locations as well. Quote tracking, quote tracking. Uh, possible high. Th these are locations of the last 24 hours, isn't it? So they were neither of them are going to go to any of these locations. What other information do we have on any of these things? I guess we need to actually start digging. Yeah, in a lot of instances, maybe we need to start digging through actual details. Cur uh, lives at Malloy Court, Farview. Would be you really useful if I knew if it, it told you what these thing these things are? But at the same time, the how man. So I know her address is Malloy Court, and this is Harrison's tracking. So where's she been? I'm like, I'm looking at the wrong tracking anyway. She has been home. She has been to Malloy Court, Farview. Oh, right, okay. Stelligan Avenue, I guess, is Stelligan, which, because we know she logged into her webmail at the university, tells us she was there, and also she hangs out at the university a lot. Rosen Plaza is going to be Rosen Tech. We know she's been there all weekend. Penn Street. What's on Penn Street? I don't know what's on Penn Street. At the same time, I kind of need to find locations that she has been to before that aren't on this list, so... Man. Where... I feel, I feel like it would highlight things and give me an option to drag and drop them if I thought they were hiding out there, though. And the only places it's given to me to pick as possible hideouts are these. And it can't be any of these. So I don't get where else I could even offer them as a thing. If there was like one of the other bars or clubs or something that they'd mentioned and I had any incl inclination as to where those were, it, even then it hasn't given me the option to drag that to Orwell. It's still not helpful. Uh, I don't... I don't know. I'm not sure where to go. I have been back and forth through these files for maybe quarter of an hour. 
reading and trying to figure things out. And I recognize I've still got at least two data chunks left, so maybe those are critical. Maybe I need to uncover more of things. The idea that maybe, maybe, maybe I could pin it down before I run out of data chunks, maybe that's too optimistic. Maybe I'm not even supposed to find where they're at until after I've done 20 data chunks. One thing I did find is that friggin' thing that was annoying me for the longest time on... Uh, da, 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 where is it? Timelines? Harrison's timeline. That was a... he did do a second article piece that really doesn't enlighten as much as just him sucking up to the government a little bit more. Like last week I said some bombs went off and then bombs kind of went off so whoops, I... yeah, no, probably shouldn't have said that. Um, yeah, um, and... Oh uh, yeah, well, pro security. Yeah, sure. Not a lot useful in there. All I can think is, and I know I keep getting told off for this. Project Demiurge. Can we get information on this thing? Because we had we've had this name before. This name's come up multiple times throughout the course of this game. This must be useful, right? Demiurge must take us somewhere. Tell us what the hell Demiurge is. Oh, there's a document! Huh! And the fact that she's commanding me to do it tells me I must be on the right path. This has got to be right. Must be. She wouldn't be commanding me to do this if this were wrong. I command you to no longer dig around in Abraham Goldfell's past. I would easily turn you into a target person for disobeying me. You would not want that, do you? I thought the whole point of me being an investigator for Orwell is I'm not part of the nation. I'm not actually under your jurisdiction. I don't live in this country. Isn't that kind of how the system works? They hire people from outside of the nation to spy on people within the nation? You know, just like Donald Trump hired Russia to spy on Hillary Clinton uh, so that the media would kick it up into a frenzy and she would lose the election. Just saying. I could easily turn you into targets. No, you can't. You're threatening. What's so strange there is that Julius, Julius requested material on this demiurge. Ah! You're on my side. Huh. I, can, I can turn you around on this. Yes, Julia did request information on Demiurge. And we got a new... Oh, we got a new post, okay. Dun dun dun! Dramatic music! Now I am become death, the destroyer of worlds. Oppenheimer quoted when he realized when he made the nuclear bomb possible. For the first time, I feel I truly understand what he meant. I know it's impossible to stop progress. I thought I could could change what was coming, control the inevitable. From within, I cannot. I made a mistake. I must quit at once. The only thing I can do is to seek redemption, so let this be my confession. I, Abraham Goldfels, developed the so-called Ethical Codex for a project codenamed Demiurge, which has been renamed Orwell, and I approve for everything I am about to write Clone to a device with the UID PC 68334-9021. Oh, well, it's the most sinister project I can think of. A system to spy on every last citizen in the nation. Is there something good on that PC? There must be something good on that PC. Although it's commanded not to dig around in Goldfell's past. My intention was to govern this highly invasive project by applying strong ethical constraints on what it can access and how that access is granted. I was given a lot of freedom in this regard, yet that was not enough. Seeing this thing in action, I can only look at myself in disgust for being so naive that I ignored the danger that was staring me in the face. Even when the system is investigating targeted persons, it will jump from one individual to another, ultimately passing all of their indiscretions and making everyone a target. Each test indicated one true fact. No one is innocent. I feel the urge to run to the press to give them conclusive evidence that all will exist. Yet I ask myself, will it achieve anything? Just another news piece lost in the crowd, one that will be drowned out by the latest timeline scandal or whatever Rosen's eating for breakfast. I don't I'll even have enough strength to leave this article live on the blog. I can't handle the shame of what I've done. I bet they'll start using the project against me and then others I'm connected to. It'll be for the best if I just archive it. I need to commit my th but I need to commit my thoughts to words, even though even if they are just for myself. No comments. Uh, this was a couple of years ago. I was like, this wasn't recent. Oh, I saw February. I saw February for a moment. I was like, hang on, he died in January. Oh, December. I keep thinking it was January. It was December. Okay. Uh, yeah, we yeah we want we want we want that PC. Two uploads remaining. Oh, so you knew it now. Oh, that's why she didn't want me digging around in it. Oh, yes, we hired him for Orwell. This is his doing. 
It was me who wanted him on the project in the first place, to get things right with all well, to follow ethical standards. Only very few people here knew that, and I wanted to make sure it stayed that way. Our most ferocious enemy worked for us, a person I chose. Now you, all, now you know it all. Discovered by the very tool it was all about, and the irony is not lost on me. But well, you chose to... But well, you chose to disobey. I've warned you before, this will have consequences for you. Oh. Oh, shoot! Oh, oh, oh dear! <laughs> God! <laughs> Joseph Langley is connected to De Catherine Delacroix, who's connected to Maroka. 